Hi, in this video we'll be looking at how to remove noise from your audio recording. In our previous video, I've looked at how to download, install, and get started with Audacity. So in this video, I'm assuming that you already know how to record and do simple editing. If not, you can watch my previous video, so you'll be familiar with that. So I'm just going to get right into this uh, process. So I've already pre-recorded this um, audio with some noise in the background. I'm going to play it back for you to hear and then we're going to show you what it sounds. We're going to do the editing to remove the noise and play again for you to hear what it sounds like with the noise removed. Okay, so here we go. We're going to go from the beginning and uh, let me just try and play that for you to hear. Uh, let's see, my speakers are here. Good. Let's try now. I think it's a little. Let me stop doing? this. I'm going to replay. I think it's a little bit low. So I'm going to turn up my audio a little bit higher. All right. Let's go back to the beginning. Let's play that again. Good day, everyone. How are you all doing? It's all right. So I'm sure you could hear the noise in the background there. And notice I had left a, a space before, some time before I started a recording. It's always good to do that, especially if you're in a noisy background. So you can later, when you're doing your editing, remove that noise from your audio. So how I'm going to do this, the first thing you want to do here, and this is how it works in Audacity, is once you have established the noise, the area that uh, is noisy, and you can see that's a very uh, straight line here, um, this area at the beginning uh, is the noise that we have in our audio. Of course, the, we're seeing the little mountains and the waves going very high. That's where I started uh, talking. So I'm going to highlight this portion here at the beginning, and then I'm going to go to the option for effect. Right? I'm going to go all the way down to the option for noise reduction. Uh, the reason why I highlighted that noise area is because we have to create what we call a noise profile. Uh, the idea is, let me click on this first and I'll show you. Noise reduction, so we're going to go to effect, noise reduction, click on that. And then notice here we have three steps. Step one is we have to get the noise profile. And before you can actually click on this option for it to work, you have to have highlighted first the portion that you consider noise in your audio, okay? And then we have step two um, where we're going to actually do the reduction, all right? So um, we may need to repeat this process depending on the amount of noise that we have in our audio. So first of all, let's get the noise profile and we have to, we have to go again. And this time, uh, instead of highlighting just the noise, we're going to highlight everything, okay? So I'm going to just, uh, let me make sure it's back to the beginning. And you can either click on select here, okay? Or you can click on control, use a combination key on your keyboard, control A, to select all that is on your current track. So I'm going to go back now, but this time, um, I've already built a noise profile, so when I go back to effect and noise reduction i'm pretty much trying to reduce the noise now from the entire that portion that we had selected first to get a noise profile we're now trying to remove it from the entire track so um the default here is usually about 12. i'd beef this up because i know there's a very noisy background and then i'm gonna have to do this a number of times so the default is usually 12 for noise reduction and sensitivity six, frequency three. Usually you can leave that at default if it's not very noisy, but you can always, for the noise reduction, you can bump that up a little bit if it's a very noisy background. So I'm gonna click on okay here, and uh, you'll notice that the, it's gonna take a while. You'll notice that the line that was there representing the noise got a lot thinner that is to show you that something would have uh, some changes would have occurred there and uh, we can replay this 
uh, to let you hear what it sounds like. So I'm going to do that now. I'm going to just click on the play button and we'll see. I'm going to turn this up a little bit more so we can see as much um, as possible what has changed. Okay, so let's listen again. Notice a little bit lower. Good day, everyone. How are you all doing? All right, so notice the noise has gotten a little bit uh, lower. So what that means is some amount of reduction was done. We're going to do this process again. So I'm going to control A. I'm going to go back to the beginning um, of my track here. Control A to highlight everything. We're going to do it one more time to see if we can get it down, you know, a little bit more. Noise reduction. So effect, noise reduction. Going to leave it as 36 for the no noise reduction there and sensitivity everything else default click on ok all right let's listen to it one more time and see what has occurred here let's go back to the beginning notice you're not hearing anything now very low good day everyone how are you all doing all right so this is pretty much the process you go through to reduce noise in audacity and I hope that this video actually helped you. And if it did, I'm going to ask you to share it with someone. Subscribe to the channel for more. And also leave a comment and like this video. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in our next video.